six-ish. Yeah, so I think we're gonna try, at request of one of our viewers, to get out of Arizona. I think we've seen enough. So even if the money's good, we're getting the hell out. I don't wanna do Arizona, I don't wanna do Arizona, 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 Arizona. Jeez. Arizona, Arizona, okay. You know what though? 5,800 as opposed to six. So we're, we're losing $1,000 to get out of just to do it to California to California. So maybe we'll just do the thing where we take Arizona out to California and then we'll only okay. lose a couple. We'll get out of Arizona this way. So that's what we'll do. This couldn't happen again. This is that that's right. All right then. <sighs> Feeling good about this one. Uh, today, zero damage. That's gonna be our goal. Zero damage. Okay, so, off to California. Ooh, it's raining. Fun, and it's nighttime. So let's turn on our lights. Oh wait, we gotta start the engine. There's our lights, okay. Wipers, I think it's P. Yeah, there we go. Let's see the speed we can do. Okay, so we have two speeds. Oh, uh, I think we're headed to Barstow. Wonderful Barstow. It's not raining that hard, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Let's see what we're doing. We're oh, look what we're hauling. You know, my grandfather actually has one of these at his house, and I do get to drive one semi frequently for somebody who doesn't drive heavy machinery for a living. I do get to drive a backhoe every once in a while that has a bulldozer and then the backhoe like the, the crank. And then it goes and then the arm goes and then it goes something like that. It's like uh, it's kind of like driving a Tonka truck that you remember as a kid. Except it's big and it can do a lot of damage and you can take the corners off of uh, carports. Okay. Oh, see, I was reading a text on the screen. Don't worry. No problem. We didn't make, we didn't uh, get any damage. So we're in. Yep. Looking good. That's true, I can haul it. I am a uh, trained professional truck driving hauling. I mean, I did use an actual trailer this weekend. I mean, it wasn't a big long one like this, but you know, I can drive a trailer. It's easy. And I can drive a backhoe. That's easy. So I can do two things. It's better than no things. All right, let's put on our blinker. Also, let's get inside of our truck. What are we doing? All right, we got the green arrow. All right, clear. We cleared it. All right, everything's looking 100%. Got a nice rainy night ahead of us, guys. It's only 10:30. You've got your coffee. We got a got your seat right there. Looking good. Ooh, put our blinker on. Let's get over. That's right. On the road again, guys. It's fun, right? Driving. So we've got our brights, too. Well, let's not use our brights. That's, that's not nice. Hopefully, the music picks up here. In a minute. Oh, man, it smells good in my house right now. It's cashew chicken night. It's always a good night because that means leftovers for work tomorrow. And uh, with it being Wednesday, this is fantastic. I don't know if I've ever told you about my uh, uh, weekday hierarchies, but it's fairly obvious in a way. But here's the kicker: Monday is not the best, is not the worst day of the week. It's not. It feels like it might be. I know Mondays, whatever. Blah blah blah. Mondays always happen. Always will happen. You know, just Mondays. Whatever get through them and before you know it most of the time the day's over but I think uh, Tuesdays Tuesdays are the worst day of the week they're worse than a Sunday they're worse than a Monday they're worse than a Wednesday Tuesday
Tuesdays suck. Tuesdays are no man's land. There's nothing on TV. Or there didn't used to be. I don't know. Maybe there is now. I don't really watch a lot as much as I used to. Oh, let's turn our wipers off. Okay. But yeah, it's, uh, you know, it's not Monday. You've dealt with that. But it's not quite Wednesday. It's not the middle of the week. Wednesday after lunch, after lunch, you're on the downhill, baby. You're going straight down that roller coaster hill. You should be thrilled. Oh, shit! Okay. No, we're good. We're, we're good. That was, that was almost bad. But why is it telling us to do that? We could have stayed on the road. Well, that's stupid. Yeah, anyway, then Thursdays are a Thursday. There's, there's nothing really to say about Thursday. But then... Fucking <laughs> Saturday. Works on a Friday. You come in 15 minutes late and you use a side door, that way Lumberg doesn't see you. Stroll in 10 minutes late for lunch. With everybody else, I might add. It's not like everybody doesn't fucking do it on a Friday. That's when everybody gets in their little groups and goes to lunch. And they'll say, We're leaving at 11.30, but we're coming back at 12.15. And you're like, Oh, you naughty bitch. You're going for a long lunch. Yeah. But she's going with her boss. So. Like he's, she's going to get dinged for it. And he's not going to get dinged for it. So you're really just bragging about having an extra little bit of lunch. The rest of us have to be back at 10 after. Anyway. Favorite bar has half a on Tuesday. guy knows what's up. He doesn't even probably want to be there. He would probably be, rather be at home just sleeping off a day. You know, if they said to you, like, what if they said this? They go, like, alright, here's the deal. You can have a four-day work week. Tuesday, you are totally confined to your home with no internet access. That sucks. But yeah, I could probably deal with that still. I'd go out and do some yard work and stuff and some shit done. You know, you know how much that would do for fucking people? productivity if he's just like all right Tuesdays we're cutting the goddamn internet off we're cutting the TV off you all go do all those fucking chores you've been putting off stop being hoarders go take care of shit clean your goddamn garage out go do, go develop a new craft for your own beer uh, you know try to get into some sort of black market activity I don't know cut yourself whatever you want to do that's new and exciting to you you should be able to do it on Tuesday. That's where you take Tuesday back to take it back from the man. Because honestly, that's the only real fucking reason that Tuesday's bad in the first place. Tuesday isn't inherently bad. It's it, it's innately neutral. It's a day. And it's only a day because we make it a day. There's no such thing as Tuesday. That's a retarded. The fucking Earth spins around and goes around the sun, and there, there's nothing that dictates that one of those spins is Tuesday again and again and again and again. You know? Fucking Tuesday. The vehicle inspection. Offline games. See, and you know, that's actually a really good point. What if on, uh, what if on that Tuesday, you just go through your single player library? You wouldn't believe how many single player games I have on Steam right now that I haven't played at all. I haven't played at all. And they're really good, and I know they're really good. Oh shit. Not good. Let's see what we got. Offline games. You could play your old offline games that you get online on. Well, hold on. We. I think my point of the of cutting off the internet was to cut off this whole thing, all of it. That's pretty authoritarian, though. Kind of dictatory. Dictatory. Just hanging out now at the way station. Hanging out at the truck stop way station. So we got some text on my actual phone. Class acts, the rest of the class acts. Have I not talked about them yet? Oh my god. You see that fucking thing in the corner? That's the class acts logo. It was developed by one of the class acts, or a couple probably. I don't even know. We've got this whole motif going on. Classy as fuck. 
We're all dapper. We have a hat club, which is growing in members. We have a, a, an annual video game tournament, which is fucking phenomenal. I came in second. Uh, we raised like $1,700 uh, one year. And then this year, we raised like $1,200. It's crazy. Charity for kids. So that's classy is what that is. We got, uh, we got all these members, all of them. Actually, we're a pretty exclusive club of uh, six. We really don't let many people in, because I'm going to be quite honest here. One thing that you'll notice about the class acts is that we're not exclusionary as much as there's just requirements to get in. That's, that's not the same thing. I mean, anyone could potentially be a class act, and we just have to feel that they meet our strict uh, requirements for class and poise and uh, panache. You know? You gotta have something a little extra. You can't just show up with fucking manners. What kind of robot are you? And yes, the hat club is pretty amazing. I thought about wearing my hat today, but then I thought, well, I can't use these stupid cans we put on our head. If I had another way of doing things, if I had another way of a, a better setup, if I had a, if I just had a different method, maybe I could wear the hat and uh, show people the, but uh, yeah, we do. We have to have standards. It's not our fault. It's just the way the club was set up. Rules are not meant to be broken in the class acts unless you're looking really cool doing it. Um, you know, we play a lot of payday because you get to wear a suit, mostly, I think, is why we play. Um, all sorts of games. Oh, GTA, because we wear suits in GTA, too. Listen, if you're going to do anything, the best option to do it is to do it good and you know above that and even above that I will say this if you're going above that doing there's nothing more important in life than being cool and when you're classy as fuck you're really cool I I would cite uh, that that Mad Men show look at that guy he's all cool as shit and classy to boot why? Because one brings the other. One invites the other. Alright, so we're going to go straight instead of doing that. Man, it's uh, one in the morning, guys. We've been driving for a while. Oh! Ah, man, that was close. I had to put on the brakes for that hairpin. Do a little bit of a clover. Speaking of clover, Payday 2 is one of the best games ever made. When we stream that shit, you guys better get on and watch because there's nothing better than watching us go to work. And that's what I call it. I call it going to work. We're not heisting. I mean, we are, but I call it going to work because that's a classier way of saying it. It's not so much on the nose. Sometimes, you know, you gotta, you gotta fluff things a little. You gotta, you know, you gotta stimulate a little bit. You know, you gotta like rub in circles, uh, you know, with two fingers. Sometimes that's what you have to do. Thank you, that was that was a very... I thought I was going to get the damage on that one, and we ended up not getting it. So, kudos to us. Kudos to us. This drive is going phenomenal. I mean, we haven't hit anything yet, and uh, we're just hauling ass. 70 miles an hour and 55. It was any cops. Blowing them away. Blowing them away. So... Finally got out of uh, out of Arizona. I was getting real sick of that goddamn place. I mean, the sunsets are nice. You're going through, you see. The, is it painted desert in Arizona? You guys know? I want to say it is. Say that in New Mexico, but I don't think we can go to New Mexico in this game yet. Now, I personally live in Texas, so I'm really hoping that at some point we get a uh, oh shit. Slow, slow, slow. We get a Texas DLC. Man, that'd be cool. We could drive from Fort Worth to Dallas and sit in uh, two hours of traffic for 30 miles of highway. That would be fun and realistic. We could drive through downtown Dallas and uh, sit in uh, two hours of traffic for a three mile stretch of highway. So that would be even more fun. It is in Arizona, okay. Yeah, the Painted Desert in Arizona. Uh, beautiful. 
so much, so much beauty, so much beauty. Now, where I really want to go in this game is uh, I want to get out into the, the Nevada area. Oh shit! Okay, we got it. We took, we took that turn. I want to get out into the uh, the Mojave area, see some fallout areas. I know you can go near Prim. I know you can go near Good Springs. I know you can go near all of those places that actually do exist. And they also exist in the game because they're based on the game was based on a real place, not just a made up place. It's interesting. And uh, I don't know if you know this, but Fallout 3, really, actually, the, uh, the shelled out city is um, modern day DC. So, hey guys, we made it. Well, we almost made it. And now we made it. Oh yeah! Uh, uh, uh. You know what that means. Park this bitch. Okay, so but see that thing is, is that I'm really not good at parking. So, I guess I'm gonna just try to do it this way because I'm not really good at doing it the other way. Okay, so no damage, right? We don't want any damage. <gasps> Shit! Oh God, you fucked it up already, idiot. We're already there. Okay, 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 okay. No, I would never auto park. <laughs> Differential! Okay, so if we just barely tap it, maybe we won't take damage. We need 90 XP. Differential, don't fail me now. Come on! Okay, can we back up? Uh-oh. Oh god, no. Ah, shit. Back it up. Back it on up. Back it on up. Brute force it, come on! Come on! We got it, we got it, we got it. Everybody. We got it, we got it! <clears throat> Shit, it's not going anywhere. Let's back her up. Okay, we just like, uh. Oh, this is bad, guys. How are we going to get this? Yeah, so that way goes... Yeah, just like that, right? I think we can do this still. See, we keep shifting backwards. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. We got it. That's it. Oh, you see that? Okay, go, baby, go. Go, baby, go. Come on. She's not backing up anymore. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. We went that whole way. We're not giving up now. Alright, so we're gonna straighten her out. Yeah! Go, man! Go! Back her up! Back her up! Back her up! Yes! Do it! Do it! Ride that edge! Look at that! Front left, front right tire there. Ride that edge! Ride it! Yes! Come on. Come on, I just need you a little more. Come on. Come on! It's never over. It is never over. What the fuck? No! What happened? 
Yes, get over, get over that hump. 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 Get over it. Come on. Okay. Well, whatever. We're going to back it up. All right. So that spun us around. So let's see if we can... Uh... Yeah. Get over. Come on. What are we stuck in? We're moving. Straighten out. Straighten out. Straighten out. You're straightening out. Keep going, baby. You got it. Keep going. We're almost there. I see it. I see us moving. We're moving on those back tires. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna try one more time up front. So now we're going to turn the other way and see if we can get off this platform. I think we got it this time, though. out of a tight spot. So let's take our differential down, maybe. maybe that'll help. So where are we stuck? Looks as if we're not stuck on the fence. It looks like we're stuck. These wheels can't get any traction, it looks like. Alright. Hey, no worries. Yeah, I would like to get out of the truck and walk around a little bit. Alright. You know what? I have a feeling. I have a feeling about this. This is bad. This is bad news. So wait, we go this way and not go that way. Let's just swing the let's just swing the cab around. Let's put this thing up against the wall. We can do that. Going a little slow. Oof. Guys, stick with me. I know that this is not good, but I have a feeling. We're almost off the platform. I feel like if we can get off this stupid platform. Keep going. Oh, this is so slow. Alright, I'm going to need some support here. You guys, what I want you to do is start clapping your hands together. Snapping. Something, man. I need some... I mean, we're off the platform. If we can just get off this little hill. And look at that. Look how far back we are now. So let's just turn this and see if this works. Clap, 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 and clap, 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 clap. Looks like we're getting some movement there. Where are we getting the most movement? Looks like we're getting some movement. Looks like we're getting some movement here. Oh shit! Looks like we're getting some movement! Oh shit! Right fucking there, man. That is where 
Real truckers are made. Did you guys know that? And you know what else? I'm not gonna even, I'm going, man. I'm just gonna go slower. Check that shit out, huh? Yeah! Feel good about that one. I gotta be. If I'm being honest, that one felt pretty damn good. That one felt pretty damn good. Can't believe it. That took like a good eight minutes or so, I'm sure. But um, you know, I appreciate appreciate you sticking through it. You know. That's uh. You know what the best part is? Zero damage. That is really the best part. I do have to back up a little bit here. And that's that's all right though. I'm not doing. <laughs> I'm not doing so well here on this. So I do apologize. I told you I wasn't that great at backing up, but I'm telling you, getting off that uh, platform, fuck, that was good. I'm not even gonna pretend that it wasn't. There we go. That looks to be pretty. No. Hmm. Guess what? That's our first. Uh, Excellent. That's our first excellent, guys. We did it. We did it. Yeah. All right. Well, that's uh, that's great news. Yeah, there is a higher grade than tolerable, which uh, I wasn't aware of, and I, I gained a level from it. So uh, we're going to go more high-value cargo, because we want our truck. Give us all of the high-value cargo. Apply it. <laughs> I'm feeling fucking invincible right now. Let's go for another one. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. Arizona to Barstow again. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Phoenix to El Centro. Where is El Centro? South, huh? What else we got? We have... Yeah, a lot of goddamn Arizona, huh? Let's see what's over in Bakersfield. Ooh, to San Francisco. Done. I'm not even going to look at the money. Hope you guys have a drink with you. I'm drinking a... Uh, a uh, delicious flat Pepsi today. Mmm. Ugh, tastes like eventual diabetes. Fantastic. So we're driving one of these uh, Kenworth, I guess. Yeah, Kenworths. See, this one doesn't have a cab in it. But your seat's pretty nice. It's a bucket seat. No? Alright. I'm happy about this. We don't have a very far trip. I'm on top of the world. So it's interesting you mentioned that, Penguin. I uh, happened to write a uh, fanfic about Payday and Truck Simulator. It happened to do with a new uh, member to the Payday gang who just happened to be a truck driver. Maybe someday I'll post it when I finish it. You know, as is, it's pretty, you know, unfinished, as I would call it. And I tried to put pictures in it from the game. So one of the pictures was of my truck that I had bought because I was playing European Truck Simulator, right? And 
and so I was like, well, maybe the heister is going to be from Europe. He was. He was from Scotland. And so that's where I named, okay, and then if you think about Payday, you're like, well, there are other Irish characters. There's, uh, I think there is another Scottish, Bonnie, that's Scottish. Uh, so there are some, some European characters. So also the Butcher, who is one of your job uh, providers, is also like, uh, where was she from? Uh, Prague, from the Czech Republic or something. And so I, I uh, incorporated the locations and I ended the first part of the, the uh, story as they were meeting the butcher and it was like, you ready to go to America? Because the guy starts out, he doesn't even, he has just a truck driver, but then he gets offered a job and then they get attacked and then he has to run some people over. It gets into a whole thing, you know? But, uh, I, I you know, I think if I'm reading a book, I'd read this book. I mean, I wrote this book. It's not a book. I wrote this story. And if it were to be made into a motion picture called American Truck Simulator slash Payday Fanfic, I think people would go to see it. It's a working title, but the meat is there, is what I'm saying. We haven't had a good heist movie in a while. I don't know if you guys have ever seen Heat, but Heat is seriously one of the best heist movies ever. That's right. Oh my god, my dinner's ready. And I can't upset my wife. Oh shit! Guess what, guys? I do have to go. I shouldn't have started another one. I'll tell you what, though. I will be back after my dinner for another stream. Because I really want to finish this one. So what we're going to do, I'll tell you what, let's just pull in right here, because we're at a Ray's Burgers right now. I'm going to park, and I'm going to illegally park, and block all of these people in, right here. I'm going to turn the engine off, get out, I'm going to go have myself a Ray's Burger. I'm actually having cashew chicken. I will be back later. Thanks for watching. Please come back and see me whenever I come back. We're going to be going to San Francisco. I don't know what's there except for uh, the destination. So maybe we'll find a new truck dealership. Maybe we'll find... I don't know. Ray's doesn't have the best cashew chicken, but luckily I'm going to get a burger. Ray's with a strawberry milkshake. I'm going off the grid here. Strawberry milkshake? You don't ever see people get that anymore because Ray's does it with real strawberries. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Thanks for watching.